Hello, Valder. Valder, how you doing? Hi, can you guys hear me? Oh, yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for joining us here on the Valder BB Show. It's my pleasure to talk with you guys. Well, thanks for having us. Well, no problem. I wanted to let my audience know that I'm speaking to Ron and John Daniels. They're the star of the all-new series on Animal Planet called Redwood Kings. Guys, uh, I'll start with Ron. Ron, tell me about this amazing talent you have, and then I'll talk to John about this great opportunity <laughs> that you have. Amazing talent. Uh, gosh, I... <laughs> <laughs> Where do we begin? Um, you know, we're, we're just really lucky to be able to do what we do. And, and we, we just travel the world building tree houses and shooting galleries and themed environments and animatronics. And we just do crazy things. Uh, and, the, and, and where does all this come from? It's a combination of incredible talent, starting with John and myself, but our team back home, led by Mark, our, our foreman, who you'll see on the show. We just have an amazing group of just really, really good great people and because of all that you know we have this collective talent okay now you guys i guess you call you guys environmentalists because from what i read i'm not sure you guys use fallen wood right is that true oh yeah yeah a lot of the stuff we use is reclaimed one way or another um, our yard is full of you know timber to uh, boards and things that we find uh, old rusty things that we use for decorations barn uh, wood you know, you, you know, barnwood shingles, you know, we just, anything that we could find, we turn into treasure. Mm -hmm. So do you guys have a reverence for nature or wood or you just like wood? <laughs> well, you know, we grew up on a, on a ranch and, uh, you know, we just started at an early age, started building things with leftover ranch wood. You know, uh, the horses would, you know, chew a fence down or something. So we'd use the the leftover wood to, to build our clubhouse or something. Mm -hmm. And I think that's where it started when we were kids. So, but, you know, we quickly realized when we build these structures and we do these things with all this old reclaimed material, it has a spirit and a charm that just resonates with people. And they love it for the same reason we do. And so we're like, hey, I think we're on to something. And uh, it, it puts this, it puts an amazing charm and character into our work that new materials just can't do you know a sense of time you know when you when you look at the pieces they're timeless but you know just thinking about the history part of whatever we build it has history and sometimes thousands of years of history which is fascinating i think ron and i are uh, really into the history part of it are you guys yeah. are of one soul let me ask you tell you what i mean but i just found out today that you guys are twin brothers so you <laughs> yeah we're yeah, you think do you think alike and talk alike, and this is you know where you guys really come together. I mean, well, yes and no. John's right-handed. I'm left-handed. I'm a mathematician by education. He's an amazing artist. So in those respects, you know, a lot of re things were just kind of polar opposite. But we've been working shoulder to shoulder with our other brother Jim, you know, even as well since we were little kids. And so, yeah, I mean, we're from this tight-knit family that grew up on a ranch, and we had to work together to survive and make a living. So. You know, sometimes Ron and I will complete a sentence, you know, because we think a lot alike, but we're pretty much opposite, as opposite can get. Yeah. Well, you guys, well, those are all ingredients for a good married couple. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's the yin and the yang, and, and, and you got to have it because we, we keep each other grounded. I think, uh, you know, you can't have one without the other sort of thing. So. Very complimentary, you know, roles that we that we take on in the business. Well, I was trying to dissect what is your secret to success, and you've just told me you have all these these same things going and these opposite things going. I think this is going to make you guys a big success on Animal Planet, one of my favorite channels. I have to say that. Thank you very much, and I'll, and I'll tell you, people, are, you're going to see what we're talking about by the end of the season. All these, every episode is going to be completely different, and you're never going to see the same thing twice. They're going to run out of film before they run out of fascinating topics at Daniels Woodland. And by the end of this season, people are going to go, my goodness, what else can these guys do? It's so incredible. And uh, hats off to our team because, you know, everyone, this collective talent, we do some crazy things. And uh, I think people are going to be inspired, and they're just going to love it. Okay, a couple things. i got to wrap up now. But I, yeah. we put you guys out there on Facebook. The ladies want to know who's single, who's available. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. We're both married. Sorry. We're 20 oh, years late there. <laughs> it's my job to ask the question. And when do you guys want us to watch Redwood Kings? Fridays at 9 p.m. I thank you, guys. I wish you the best. I know this is going to be a great show. I can't wait till you come back and tell me about your success. Thank we you will. So Thank you much. for having us. Thank you. 
So long, bye.